Berkeley Millen and I'm here to demonstrate the SharePoint Sites web part which is powered by Jive and brought to you by 3 -Wheel. This web part can be used to uh, show a list of sites that uh, you care about. You can tag some sites as ones that, uh, that are your SharePoint sites. You can also hover over those sites and look at uh, the recent content that's occurring within those sites, the recent activity. First off, we need to go ahead and install the web part. So I'm going to I'm logged into the server here and you run this uh, quick and easy installation. During this, you need to choose what site collections you want to install this on. I'm going to install this on two different site collections. And during this time, it's going to deploy that out to uh, every server in the farm. Okay, now that's completed. We're going to go ahead and go to our SharePoint site. In here, we're going to want to um, first let's refresh our page. Our site's been reset. Now I'm going to go in and edit the page and add our web part. And this is the SharePoint sites web part. Go ahead and add it. And you can see that uh, right now there's no SharePoint sites for my user, but I can see all the, the nearby SharePoint sites, which are those in my current site collection. So I can hover over any one of these, see the recent activity within there, and choose to follow it or not. So I'm going to follow a few of these sites. And now when I go into uh, my SharePoint sites, I'll actually see those sites here. And maybe I want to stop following one of those. So it, it maintains a, a set of sites you care about. It can also do this across site collections. So if I go to another site collection within my farm, I previously installed the web part here, just so I don't have to waste my time adding the web part to the page and we'll see that we do have those those SharePoint sites that are the ones I specified on the on the previous uh, tab that I was on but here the nearby sites are all those within this site collection and I'm going to add this three wheel dev root site I'm going to follow that one so now I see not only my sites from one um, site collection but I see another site from another site collection if I come back here refresh my page I'll see that I have both sites from uh, two different site collections, basically. And that's, uh, that's the demo. So in summary, the SharePoint Sites web part allows a user to see uh, recent content for all sites within a site collection in one easy web part. It also allows you to have access to sites which are of interest to an individual across the entire farm. If you want to download this web part, simply go to 3 slash webpart.